We got our delivery today. I didn't order it. You yeah, order it. The thing came twice. I think it came twice. I think it's the. And they took your money as well again. No, I don't think they do take my money. Okay. Maybe I'm gonna email the company. You tell them to take it back. Because I think it's the wool heart in my bedroom. Jordan, please if that water is ready. Can you help me make um, it for JD? Um, it's the wall hat in my room. I think they've sent it to me twice. Um, I wonder if I should message them and tell them that. Why are you sending me this twice? This is what I'm supposed to be doing. Sending my stuff. Yeah? Yeah. I think. I don't know. Because I don't have. I don't even have space. I think it's, this is what I order. Um... I've been waiting for this for like weeks. They have sent it, but I think right now they've sent it again. I don't know, computer error. <laughs> computer error. But I'm on a lab. Them know they see me. Pretty good day. There's no sugar there. No. Oh, where? Oh, in the sugar. Yeah. I'm, I'm actually correct. They sent the same thing. <laughs> no fail on them or no fail on me. No fail on you. Well, it's got nothing to do with me. They didn't charge me twice. Oh, okay, that's fine. But I'm gonna well, don't open it. No, no, I'm gonna email okay. them. Yeah. Because I don't know. I don't need two frame. They did send two. It's the yeah, same so thing. What, the way you can, if, even if you wanted the whole, we're gonna put it. Yeah. Well, and why do I need to the exact thing? <laughs> I don't need the exact same same thing. They've sent it twice. I'm just gonna email them. It says to have the same exact thing. No, even nothing different. Just like original. Oh no, it doesn't make any sense. Yeah. But what I'm gonna do. The third thing is now I don't have space. I don't have space for this. Yeah, where can we even put it? I'll put it under the stairs there. Mm -hmm. well, that yeah, it should be enough space. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you. Because this, this thing is big. Where am I supposed to put this? I don't have space. But that's. Anyway, bye guys. Hey guys, another day, another movie now. My musical, my music. <laughs> you guys, we, we. Oh no. By now, I'm sure YouTube would have been flagging this my video. But I would have actually taken a little bit out of it. Um, When did I last vlog? Maybe three days ago. Today is another day. And I thought we would go out. The sun is, the sun has been behaving i'm not gonna take it away from the sun and i'm not going to lie i've been enjoying the sun as well but we're going out today actually the boy wants to the boys want to go to the i i can i can't that's where we're going so i'm gonna put you guys in my bag and we are going yes i've got this my body will my up yes it's hot but my time will be coming back in the evening sometimes it get cold so I gotta be, gotta be ready. I'm still cute though. I'm cute, I'm cute. Jordan in his cowboy elements. That's my cowboy. Who had to, JD? Must you disgrace your brother? Why you looks good in the cowboy? Ah. That's nice. And Jordan is living his baby boy life. I'm not a baby. Uh, no, no, I need to put this in. Open it. <laughs> Bowling or okay? Uh, 
Oh, no, not marry again. How much is it? You have to be wise. Think about how much is it and how much you want to spend. Now, Jaden has started this. Look what you're doing. Waiting for oh, her. Yes. We are, we were about to win one of these. Again, you wanna go again? This kind of thing is gonna take all your money. Jordan, maybe Jordan should try. Because Jordan did it really well. And we're about to win one. And guess what? I was screaming. Oh sorry, babe. Jordan, be careful. Oh 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 baby Jordan might win it. Yeah, I want it up. No. Oh, let me let me do this one. Okay. One more. <gasps> Wait, where's my money? It's here. Both of you's money are here. Let's do coin collector. This one's yours, sister. Jaden has actually finished all his money. And guess who gave him money? Jordan. Jordan had to give him. Because Jaden is a... Jaden doesn't have to spend. See, Jordan still have... Jordan still have money. See Jaden's one. I want to tell you my hand. Oh yeah! Starts! I don't know who's gonna win. Well, what? Jordan doesn't watch. You never pull one out for seven zero. You can watch it. Ah, you don't have to watch it anyway. You think it's not a good game to watch. So? <laughs> Look at all our plates. I didn't know they were doing t uh, they were doing buffet. <laughs> Come on, yeah. Eh, eh, eh. Allergy is kicking me so bad. And um, did you get it? Yeah, that's it. Thank you. Uh, I want to watch cheap. You want to watch what? Cheap. What's cheap? Cheat. Cheat. What's yeah. cheat? I want to take. What's cheat? Cheat. I want to. I want to vlog. I'm going to take Jaden's AR. So maybe tomorrow I can wash it and do another one for you. But that's what we're doing. We're back home. How are you doing like a biggie boy? Okay. Anyway, I thought I would come and give you guys that update. I should have done I should have done shape up as well. And the bubbles, bro. Yeah. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Thank you. Anyway, gotta go. And kind of decisions that they made and things that they've done. So it's like, if I'm gonna bring somebody into my life, like, this person needs to understand that.
very busy 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 weekend um otega and abu came over oh i need to charge this they came over my house is a mess i actually need to maybe in the morning well we are in the morning but when the day has break properly i don't know the light over there it's i'm not liking it <laughs> When the day break properly, I'm gonna clean the what's that um, thing called sofa. I'm gonna wash it because um, that thing makes noise. If you guys have this carpet cleaner, it makes so much noise. Sorry, guys, it makes so much. Oh, this is way better. It makes so much noise. So in the morning, <laughs> I keep saying in the morning. A bit later, we're gonna clean the sofa and arrange oh i even got a flower i'm gonna show you guys that later um i wanted to give you guys some gist about love is blind i'm sure everyone is watching love is blind even if you're not a love is blind fan i am i've watched all the season i loved it from the beginning till now you know when our brothers were making a mess over making a mess of themselves last season and this season i mean i wasn't even surprised but i'm just grateful that it's not our nigerian brother this time is our Ghanaian brother uncle kwame <laughs> the thing is i personally feel like this show this is my opinion and i'm sure a lot of people would probably agree with me i think some people are going in there for the wrong reason i personally think the ones that are young let's talk about um i think his name is michelle michael no let me find his name quickly um marshall 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 and that puerto rican girl let me find their name because i need to actually know their actual name jackie they are young they're 27 i think it would be ridiculous for me to think at 27 you know what you want in a relationship you might think you have an idea you want to be in a proper relationship but you don't know what it takes and also i'm not gonna lie um what's her name again jackie jackie is so not serious i don't think she's ready for relationship she just wants to probably get into the into the show for fame and 
Marshall, on the other side, is I think he's probably ready for a relationship or is just a gen generally genuine gentleman because the guy was doing way too much in the relationship I think he was even doing most of the relationship relationship is about two people coming together and you know it's like a corporation everyone working together but he was doing most of the working and I definitely knew their relationship was not gonna last and they didn't even get to the altar before the girl break before the girl break break up with him and went went on to someone else's and I did find that a bit childish of her but then she's 27 so I wasn't expecting much of her my favorite and i know it might not be everyone's favorite is my uncle kwame and chelsea i like them and i like them apart I like chelsea because she's a very matured person she knows what she wants and i think um she wants to get what she wants but the other hand uncle kwame is not what chelsea wants I think Kwame likes the idea of dating out of his race then like like Chelsea like that I don't know if what I'm saying is making sense Chelsea is ready to to, to to be married I think he likes he likes his chocolate man she sorry she likes his chocolate man and she's very very attracted to Kwame she loves Kwame she loves everything about Kwame but personally i think kwame is not ready because all the excuses he was giving about his parents not coming to the wedding was so silly i mean i know some nigerian no no nigerian is Ghanaian. um nigerian um, Ghanaians. i mean our cultures are the same um they would at this stage they they would agree for you to marry out of your race but he was saying his parents are not gonna let him um stay with him with with her well his reason the parents are not coming is because they didn't approve of their relationship and i think that's silly because darling we're in 2023 you can never marry anybody from anywhere you can never marry your own gender self if you want to is normal nobody nobody you are and he doesn't even live his parents he lives abroad by himself he's been here since he was eight so you can't tell me he's so into his culture like that when you've not lived in the culture i beg he's lying the other people that i actually love again actually i don't like them i'm lying is um what's this girl's name mika and paul i think his name is paul yeah, she's me and Paul. Those two, they're just too young. I think they're deceiving each other. To us, this seems like they would be. I think they'll say yes to, them, to themselves. But the relationship is not going to last. Because they're just... I don't see anything that is interesting in two of them. They're both from different world. One is a scientist. And when, what does Mika do? Oh, she says she's a ma... I'm looking at it from this website so she says she's a marketing manager and that she's 27 how old is paul paul is 29 and paul is a scientist <laughs> it's just not aligned they are they are they're both of different words paul would um is a very simple guy he's not even into all these things mika is a very girly girly girl when i see the two of them together in the show I don't see the chemistry all i see is all right let's do this show let's just do this show but but there are some things oh you know what's actually funny about those two even though they are so different their parents are the opposites like Mika's parents looks like they should be paul's parents while paul's parents has, looks like they should be meek mika i don't know the other way around because mika's mika's mom she's very cool she looks like a scientific scientist mom and paul's mom is all glammed up she actually looks like mika <laughs> that was why mika and uh, paul said that he marries his mom because mika just look exactly like paul's mom then everyone's favorite everybody's favorite then they are cute I stand for black love. I love black love. I stand with it. 
but I feel like God put both of them together. I mean, that's this is Tiffany I'm talking about. Tiffany and Abu. What's our Abu's name again? I'll find his name. I always forget his name because he's just too cool, calm, collected. What's what's our Abu's name? Or what's our Tiffany's Abu's name? Yeah, I can't find his name. Or yeah, 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 yeah. I must find his name. Tiffany's boo, they are just ah, they have to work. If they don't get together, I'll go and find him and I'll put the two of them together. They have to. I can't find his name. Oh, I, I did it. I got it. Um, Bright, Brits. Brits. <laughs> B R E E B R E T T. Those ones are mature. I think if at my age, if I go to a show like that, I think that is something I would, I, I would, I, I would want to, I'll copy their style, go in there, be open, tell, it's like going to the shop to pick what you want and what you think you want. And both of them found each other. I'm so happy for them. I know they're going to work out in the outside world because both of them are mature I think one is 37 one is 36 and um, I love them I love them for the show they didn't really give me anything to talk about um, I mean as a viewer you want to watch something that is really really interesting and um, you know you want to talk about what you like what you don't like they are just so nice like when you know when you see couples are so nice they are the beyonce and 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 jay-z i love them the guy is macho the guys go good job um auntie tiffany she's really really beautiful a smile just lights up the room but she's always nervous every time i see brit and um, tiffany I just think about myself because she's worried about everything she's worried that the pressure of the thing is too much how are they going to manage or things you know i'm just like oh my god you'll be fine then the guy is always there to assure her that everything is gonna be fine this was really really nice this episode the last episode i watched i don't know what she was nervous about i think she was nervous about the wedding the cake the everything and this guy literally took out a very romantic date on this little helicopter print out some pictures um the went for i'm like oh my god 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 the went actually no god not to know when i'm ready i'll tell you <laughs> but that's a kind of relationship that you would want to be in like someone that knows what to do when you're down because i think a relationship is a two-way thing uh it's someone that it's something that a relationship is something that I think you get in uh, in order for the other person to be your pillar and you are also the person's pillar both of you lean on each other when you're down the person is willing to pull you up and you know make you make you feel good and the other way around it's not like it's just one person that's why I said I didn't like um, Kwame and um chelsea's relationship no it wasn't kwame i think it was um that was those other one the relationship was just one-sided i think that's what the, the, those ones the relationship was one-sided but my auntie tiffany and abu their relationship is two of us together we cannot do this together and i like how she, he talks about her like when he says oh what i want in a woman is some certain things and i can see he doesn't say it like i see it in someone else he sees it in her like what he wants he sees it in her i love that i love that go and date people that you want that are going to give you what you want and you you are giving them what they want that's that's what they say compact compassion companion both of you will you will, you will click like this <laughs> but i love it i would say this season is my best my actual best 
um, Love is Blind season. Amazing. I've watched every episode. Me and Tega, we always analyze all these shows and we'll just sit down or when we see each other or when we're on the phone we we'll analyze this that's how we analyze you like we talked about that show with because okay i'm gonna go soon anyway the first and um, because you is another show on netflix as well the first episode um i just didn't like it because they did part one and part two for this season of you i didn't like the part one and when me and Taylor was talking about it i was like oh, i don't think i want to watch you again because part one was a bit horrible not like it was it was horrible sorry it wasn't my expectation like i know you is always like oh my god this but it wasn't giving me that i was like i don't even think i'm gonna watch part two when i watch part two I was saying take I take I take back everything I said. The season was amazing. We talked about this for like an hour. It was so nice. Even at uni, me and some friends we were talking about it. It was so nice. So that's what um this um Love is Blind is giving, but it's a good show. It's got everyone talking. Everyone. Every time I go on YouTube, everyone is talking about it. And I love it. I love it for that. Anyway, my people, I'm gonna, as I said, I'm gonna clean this house later in the morning. I can't do it now because it's a bit too early. I need to clean all my table, all my chairs, and clean, wipe down all the surface. I'm weird like that. When people come to my house, when they leave, I do deep cleaning. It's not normal stuff. It's not normal to do that, but I like it so that I feel at peace in my house. So that's what I'm gonna do this morning and take an abu put me flowers i love it i love when people knows what i like if you come and bring me chocolate ah you're wasting your money up. <laughs> but if you bring me forever have a share nice and you bring me flowers oh i will love you and Tega always knows what i like Tega knows what i like and these flowers are beautiful um I'm gonna show you guys later, but I gotta go. I'm gonna see you guys in a few minutes. You need a new TV. Yeah. Why? Because Hello, children. How are you? Had a good sleep? Yeah. Mm -hmm. These chairs I need to clean. Oh, <laughs> Why would I return it if we've had it for so long? And that one has a different shape than that. Yeah. This is this one. Anyway, can you please bring the Uber? not the Uber? Can you please bring the the chair cleaner? Did you find the glass? Did I find my glasses? Yeah. Was I looking for my glasses? Oh, you're looking for your glasses. Well, when? All your glasses, all your case. No, no. Um, stand up, please. And you, can you get Hoover? Because we, we need to clean all this, please. Thank you. this for me so I need to I need to fill this up with water first my days of um, my days of my days of um, going to Morrison Tesco and all that I'm sure they will miss me there because I, <laughs> I don't know if you guys I don't know if you guys remember when I would um, be dragging all those I mean it has to be like a long time ago maybe like four years ago and I used to drag all those um perfect cleaner from sorry when I used to drag all those carpet cleaners from um 
actually want to use one water from Morrison or Tesco or Asda because you have to you can go and rent all those cleaner but this one you don't need you don't need to rent really easy to use and you'll see the dirt and it's really easy to carry everywhere because I use them for my bedroom my bed actually my bed is it, it needs not my actual bed but the frame the bed frame is something that I've noticed that if I don't clean it properly like with those carpets cleaner they are it's not good oh, I've put too much water <laughs> this is my view I've dismantled that one and this is and it's so loud I know my neighbors will probably eat me this morning it's super loud as this is the one I have so this is the one I have spot wash it's very light you can carry it everywhere in your room and that's it so let me crack on I'll be back the noise I'm here cleaning the brush. This brush has so many dirt in it. I finished the two. I have finished the two chair. I want to do the ham, but then I can see all the. I can see that the brush is dirty. So I was like, let me use my toothpick. <laughs> let me bring you guys closer. Another day. Actually, today's. I'm gonna end this video today and i'm also gonna kind of put up the v all of the video up today um i have some clothes that i got from boohoo and i think i'm gonna show you guys because i'm going to do some returns as well so i thought i'll show you guys before i do the return let me start with this waistcoat i'm not this is gonna stay i'm still thinking i love me some denim i have a lot of jeans like denim jeans dresses skirt top i saw this on their website and i wish it kind of be able to like close but it's not closing so it's small it's small that's my conclusion it's very very small but it's cute though this is really really cute but it's small so and you see it's very the other one is this i'm not even gonna bother trying this on i'm not gonna bother because i feel like someone ordered it they didn't like it and they just squeezed it in he is not giving what he's supposed to give at all and there's a belt missing and that's the reason why i bought it because i love the color and there's a belt there's supposed to be a belt in here but the belt is nowhere to be found so this is going back i mean there's no reason why they should keep my money if i don't like their clothes so thank you very much boohoo you guys can give me my money back um where's the other one i want to show you guys show this yeah this is actually my favorite because i tried it but i think i'm gonna remove all my clothes and try it on so that you guys can see i really like this one but I, I, let me show you another one i don't have to remove all my clothes for why are they all far away <laughs> um i see if i need another jeans top because i have quite a lot but i think i like the fact that this one is white wash and it's super oversized really really like this the weather has decided not to be hot which okay i'm gonna love it but this is like an oversized denim shirt super oversized 
I'm not gonna style it for you guys. <laughs> shirt looks like it's meant to be a proper shirt, but it's super long. I love it. I can wear this with a jeans and like tuck it in like this. This is the dress I'm wearing, but this shirt is longer than the dress. You can I can also wear it like a cover up, like wear like a very nice skimpy thingy. I love the back. I love that. So pretty. This I'm not mad at. Boohoo. Well done. I'm really mad at you guys for that. You know what? It would be nice to start packing all of them. Honestly, what I want to say in my mouth there. Ugh, I'm just so angry. I'm still angry with Zara. You guys will not believe it. For a couple of weeks now. I'm still having issue with my order from Zara. I don't know what I mean. I said I don't want to go inside with I don't want to go in with the with the conversation because I'll give you guys the full gist. But this is the shirt. I love it. Love, love, love it. Have nothing to say about this. This is gonna stay as long as I've had some of this, my denim denim um top. I have this black one too. It's also from Boohoo. This black denim top is from Boohoo as well. It's not a top, it's like a dress, but this top or this dress or this jacket goes all a long way. Like I can I can style it so many ways. Now that I have this one, I really really love it. Another one that I got from Boohoo, guys, get check Boohoo out. Boohoo are doing they've always been really good with um with the denim and <sighs> Zara they're annoying me <laughs> this one also is from boohoo this is a very very long time this is like a crop crop one i have one jeans that i used to wear with this is so pretty let me see if i can still find that jeans i actually have two that i wear with i wear with that boohoo trouser this one is definitely from fashion over so when i wear this gray trouser i like to pair it up with this and I always just think I, I always look so beautiful. I love them. I love jeans. Jeans. Why am I removing all this clothes? I will still hang everything back. I'm giving myself plenty, plenty work. Ah, so that is that. Uh, what else? Oh, this one is another one that I pick up from Boohoo. Hey, <laughs> it's clean. Mm, I love it. I love this guys let me can you guys see yeah. so this is what it looks like love this I can wear like a white shirt underneath like you know those um shirt dress and I'll just put this oh you know what will go the bag that will go with this my national anthem this bag would go with this, even with this outfit. Guys, look at this. This outfit is so pretty. Even with this, my slipper safe. What else did I get? Oh, oh. This is another one as well. <sighs> you guys are, not, are gonna love this one. This one, I'm already planning occasion to go with this. But this one is beautiful. This is beautiful. This one is another one. It's denim browser and I think this will go with it. If you size me or because yesterday. How do I remove this one now? Oh okay. It's coming off. Like nothing. But it's a lot. I like so this is it. Pretty. This is this is pretty. I think I see. I really like it. Are we ready? So Zara had this um, jumpsuit. It's jeans. This is corduroy. Yeah, it's not really jeans, but it's the sister to jeans. When I saw that with Zara, I wanted it, but they didn't have triple X. No, Zara do double XXL. That's double X. You know, with jeans, I need to wear them. When I saw this on Boohoo, I was like, yes, Boru, and the length is the length for me. Kodra, I think this is what we, no, this is not Akbuchi. 
because there's one material that we call akboche but this is this one it's come with a belt but if i'm to wear it i would change the belt i would wear like another belt in it but the belts the belts also help to like snitch in the waist i i love this i have no i want to show you guys properly so that's the bottom it's so pretty if i'm wearing a belt i'll snitch it in like this so it can look like i'm wearing two pieces so this is what the back looks like oh it does come with a pocket as well so so it's pockets and it's very it's a bit stretchy i i love it i love that stretchy wide leg boohoo i love it i'm gonna end this vlog here i'm gonna put all this clothes back and tidy up the boys are fighting they're always fighting and guess who is always the fighty shady jordan's always fighting jordan but anyway guys hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and i'll see you guys in the next one hopefully soon all my order from zara will come and i can give you guys the full gist i think zara needs to give me compensation at this rate at this rate <laughs> anyway bye guys